Hello children, welcome to EVS class. In today's EVS class, we will start a new chapter, chapter number 19, Our Nation. What is nation? Nation means our country. Children, what is the name of our country? Yes, the name of our country is India. We live in India, right? Thus, the people in India are known as Indians. We are all known as Indians. You know, children, India is the seventh largest country in the world as per area. Now tell me, what is the capital of India? Yes, New Delhi is the capital of India. It is situated in the northern part of India. Children, look at this map of India. Can you see the square box? It's our capital of India, that is New Delhi. Our official languages are Hindi and English. In schools or at workplace, we speak Hindi as well as English to communicate with each other, right? Children, like we have different rooms in our house, we also have different states in our country. India has 28 states and 8 union territories. Our national flag is known as tricolor. Why? Because it has three colors. Do you know which colors are they? They are saffron, white, and green. That's why it is known as tricolor. The saffron color signifies the strength and courage of the country. The white color signifies peace and truth. The green color signifies the fertility, growth and auspiciousness of the land. In the center of the flag, there is a navy blue colored wheel called the Ashoka Chakra. It has 24 spokes. Each spoke on the chakra symbolizes principle of life and also to 24 hours in a day which is why it is also called as the Wheel of Time. Our national anthem is Jana Gana Mana. It was composed in Bengali language by the poet Rabindranath Tagore. It takes 52 seconds to complete. Children, every morning in the school assembly, we sing our national anthem and whenever we sing our national anthem, we always stand at attention position to pay respect and honor towards our freedom fighters who have put their lives on the front line to protect our country. Some of the names of freedom fighters who sacrifice their lives for our country are Mahatma Gandhi, Subhas Chandra Bose, Bhagat Singh, Mangal Bande, Jawaharlal Nehru, B.R. Ambedkar, Bal Kangadhar Dilak, Jandra Shekhar Azad, Rani Lakshmi Bai, Savitri Bai Phule. So children, these are some freedom fighters who sacrificed for our country. We always remember them in our prayers and pay respect for their selfless deeds. What is our national song? Our national song is Vande Mataram. It was composed by Pankim Chandra Chatterjee. The song has been translated into many Indian languages. Now children, let us learn more about India's national symbols. National flower. Lotus is our national flower. It is an auspicious symbol of India. Lotus is considered as the lucky flower. National bird. Peacock is our national bird. It is best known for its long, beautiful feathers. National animal. Tiger is the national animal of India. It ranks among the biggest cats in the world. India is home to largest number of Bengal tigers. National fruit. Mango is the national fruit of India. National tree. 
banyan tree is a national tree of india and it is amongst the largest trees in the world national aquatic animal river dolphin is our national aquatic animal national sport hockey is the national sport of india national river the ganga is our national river national currency indian rupee is our national currency national emblem our national emblem is state emblem of india it is adopted from lion capital of ashoka at sarnath it features four asiatic lions emblem symbolizes power courage confidence and at the bottom is a horse and a bull with beautiful wheel dharma chakra at center who is the father of our nation mahatma gandhi is the father of our nation he always believed in truth and non violence it means he fought wars without any weapon his only weapon was truth and non violence that's why he is known as father of our nation children there are many religious books which is being read by people of different religions but there are two great epics of india they are the ramayana and the other one is the mahabharata which provide us valuable knowledge full of devotion truthfulness and also teaches us many moral values so children in this lesson we have learned about our nation its national symbols as well as our national heroes the brave freedom fighters because of whom we got our freedom now children let's do some exercise questions from the textbook kindly turn to page number 117 Answer the following. What is the name given to the Indian flag? Why? Answer. Tricolor is the name given to the Indian flag because it has three colors: saffron, white, and green. Once again, tricolor is the name given to the Indian flag because it has three colors: saffron, white, and green. Now let's proceed to the next question H O T S high order thinking skills Name the mountain range in the north and the ocean in the south which are protecting India Answer the Himalayas in the north and the Indian Ocean in the south are protecting India Let's repeat the Himalayas in the north and the Indian Ocean in the south are protecting india all right children kindly write it down in your notebook that's the end of the chapter thank you and have a nice day